so we will see one more example here one more query that is group by query the data set that we have has tag 1 tag 2 tag 3 tag 4 if we want to find out the output from tag 1 tag 2 tag 3 tag 4 for tag what is a tag you write a question at the end of it you want to write the keyword that is for which the question is related let us say you have a question on HTML related content then your tag will be HTML you have a question on Excel related content your tag will be Excel at the end of the question so we want to see what are the most used tags for let's say for each of the tag let's say HTML how many out of these six million records how many are related to HTML how many are related to C++ how many are related to how many questions are related to Excel how many questions are related to Hadoop if we just want to know that then we can write a Hadoop query how does that look like select tag one that is a field count star as tag count so we are calculating count star as tag count finally we will write group by tag one order by tag one tag one count descending basically we are grouping by tag one that means we are finding the frequency if you know SQL then you will understand this query simply basically you just take this query as it is so the basic query is select tag one count star so this is the query you can write the query directly in hive but there is a small issue here if you write the query as it is in hive you will get the output directly here and there will be so many tags the terminal will never end it there it will show so many tags then we have to uh, forcefully exit this but anyway we will write it once we will see the output but next time what we'll do we will not take the will not see the output here will directly take it into a new file so as of now we will just execute this command here select tag one so we will get the tags that means the word keyword and then the count how many times it appeared then group by like from this particular table so count will be alias as uh, tag one count from this particular table group by tag one order by tag one count so basically at the end of the day you want the tag count of the tag if you look at this SQL query carefully this is what it is exactly doing select tag one count of the tag as tag one count basically that is alias from the table the table name is tag overflow tags that is the table name group by tag one because that is where how we will find the frequency order by tag one count descending I want the most mentioned tag right in the beginning that is why I used order by also so we have used group by order by this is a simple SQL query that we wrote already many times so this is how we are executing it this command is not yet executed because we did not give semicolon that is end of the statement now it is submitted slowly map will start reduce will start once everything is over it will start the output and the output will be very lengthier very very huge so it's better to take when the output is too huge it's better to throw it into a new file but let's see the output once here map 18 percent completed 24 percent every time it shows map 100% every now and then looks like that is a small bug within this version but the actual completion of map is 36% reduce not it started map 68 percent complete
इसमें आप हंड्रेड परसेंट रिड्यूस है स्टार्टेड क्विकली एग्रीगेटिंग ऑल द रिकॉर्ड्स वंस द आउटपुट कम्स देन यू विल सी द टैग एंड दी फ्रीक्वेंसी टैग फ्रीक्वेंसी वर्ड इट्स फ्रीक्वेंसी वर्ड इट्स फ्रीक्वेंसी सो द आउटपुट मैं आप रिड्यूस स्टेज टू If we have to write MapReduce on our own, we would not have been. We would have faced lot of difficulty. We would have taken lot of time to write this kind of MapReduce code. So you have the tag and the frequency, tags and frequency, tags and frequency. Most of the times they are appearing very. Slowly. In fact, tag also people have given very huge explanation. That's the reason why we get this type of output. right we can stop it we can use control c to stop this particular execution otherwise it will go forever so basically this is to show you that how do we write hive commands they appear just like sql you run sql map reduce will be automatically starting there so you can come back to normal it will take some time but you can always exit this and then come back 